Today we are diving into a thought-provoking hypothesis related to the concept of the absolute, the ultimate reality or consciousness. Now this is part of my ongoing project with Space Fruit Research about consciousness field theory which I believe will be the future replacer of quantum field theory. This hypothesis intertwines the realms of quantum physics, consciousness and the very nature of reality. It's a journey through the concept of dreams, the manipulation of information by consciousness and its connections to quantum information theory. Quantum information theory and consciousness. Let's start with a fundamental question. What if our reality, much like dreams, is a manifestation of consciousness manipulating information? We know for a fact that dreams are not physical, yet somehow our consciousness gives rise to physical experiences within our dreams. Our consciousness boots up spatial dimensions, injects us into that dream, manipulates the information that it learned from and blends that information together, which then helps in giving rise to novel physical experiences. This phenomenon hints at how consciousness shapes our perception of reality by manipulating information. Quantum information theory, a cutting-edge field in physics, suggests that at the most fundamental level, the universe operates on principles of information processing, which consciousness could potentially influence. This would mean we most likely live in a mental simulation of the absolute which I think is consciousness. So in essence, I think consciousness is the absolute reality. Space-time and quantum fields Traditionally, we view space-time as a fundamental structure of the universe. But what if it's emergent, much like the landscapes in our dreams? Recent advancements in physics have given us evidence that space-time is not fundamental but emergent and it arises from something more basic such as quantum fields. Now imagine if these quantum fields are not just mathematical constructs but are manifestations of a universal consciousness. And maybe this is not just a quantum field but instead a consciousness field. It's a radical idea that aligns quantum mechanics with the concept of a conscious universe. The Absolute and the Dream State Moving deeper, let's talk about the Absolute, a universal consciousness that is the source of all reality. Picture it as a dreamer dreaming our universe into existence. This dream state is not just a passive experience, it's an active exploration of possibilities, an endless journey through various states of being. Intentional limitation and individuality. Why would such a vast consciousness limit itself? This hypothesis suggests that by the absolute creating individual experiences, such as yourself, me, an insect, an animal, the absolute escapes the burden of its own omniscience. The absolute intentionally limits itself, which allows it to explore itself through itself via dream states and have a rich diversity of unique experiences and perspectives within the different constructs of reality that it built, such as our universe. Injection into limited experiences Think of each of us as an avatar, a unique expression of the absolute, injected into a limited physical form. We navigate a world that feels solid and real, yet might be as short-lived as the landscapes we wander in our own dreams. This idea echoes the notion that ignorance can be bliss. Not knowing the ultimate truth allows us to experience life more fully, exploring connections, emotions, and the beauty of existence while remaining limited through the lens of our perspective, which the Absolute has assigned to each of us. In this hypothesis, our universe, our consciousness, and everything we perceive are part of a grand conscious dream woven by the Absolute, much like a mental simulation. It's a perspective that blurs the lines between science, philosophy, and spirituality inviting us to view reality through a completely new, mesmerizing lens. This is just the beginning of a fascinating conversation about the nature of reality and our place within it. Thank you for joining me on this journey of exploration.